Hey guys, welcome back. Next Media Girl here. Um, so today we are trying out some new pigments that were sent to me by Laura Usher, and these are Le Res. Um, so these are epoxy pigment pastes, and these are metallic epoxy pigment pastes. So they sent me Sassy Red, and she sent me Angel White. This one, oh no. I ripped a bit of the label off with the tape. Um, this one's a blue, blue star. <laughs> and then we have an electric green. All right, and then uh, some of the mica powder samples as well. So today what we're gonna be using is the white epoxy paste the metallic blue epoxy paste so these two and then these two mica powders we're going to use today also um using from stone coat countertops the purple mountain metallic so i could have kind of a dark contrast and the resin that we're using is stone coat countertops art coat and that I've already mixed everything up into here. And for those of you who are new to resin, uh, definitely check out my um, resin painting for beginners video. I'll post a link to that. And I'll post a link to purchase these products if you want to try them out down in the description. So the ratios are um, 1 to 15% of the coloring to the resin. So I'd say in all of these, I have no more than about 10%. And we're gonna go ahead and get started. So this is the white pigment paste with resin, obviously. All right, and then this one is that metallic blue, which it's very kind of um, glittery. It's very pretty. Hopefully you guys can see that pretty well. And I'm gonna just go ahead and heat these up real quick with the heat gun. So I was planning on using my heat gun, but I seem to have resined it shut. So for now, we're gonna go ahead and use the torch. Sorry about that, guys. I'll we'll have to fix that later. Okay, so that just kind of heats it up a little bit. So we can move it around a little bit better. So far, very cool colors here. I love that metallic blue. I mean, white is, you know, it's white. It's not that exciting. Okay, let's get in here with some of this um, purple mountain mica powder from Stone Coat Countertops. And this is gonna be kind of our dark contrast color. Good. And then this is the Amethyst Dream. It's very, very pretty purple. You guys know I love purples. So this is Le Res Mica Powder. And then this is the Turquoise Blue. I also love turquoise. Okay, there we go. So once again, let's go ahead and torch. And I did get a new torch, guys. My dad got me a grown-up torch. <laughs> so in my upcoming videos, you'll start to see that one. Okay. Good, let's go ahead and move this around a bit. All right, I do want to use the heat gun. So I actually have my other heat gun. I am going to plug in real quick one I haven't used for a little bit because I had 
resin to that shut as well. But now it's fixed. There we go. So this is just to heat it up. As you can tell, it's not a hair dryer, so the point is not to move it around. And this heat gun literally is just heat. Whereas my other heat gun that I've been using is heat plus air, and you can control it a lot more. It has multiple temperatures. This has one temperature or one temperature only, but it's still good. And I know it looks like a hair dryer, but I swear it's not. <laughs> All right, there we go. Much more fluid now. Okay. I think I might even leave this one on the lighter side a little bit. kind of like how it's coming out. So I'm just going to hit up the edges here. I may throw a little more purple in there. These pigments are definitely gorgeous. All right, I'm going to throw more of this lighter purple. And then more of the um, turquoise as well. Okay. All right, we'll heat this up once more. All right, there we go. That is gorgeous. I'm just gonna hit up all my signs and then we'll go ahead and go in for a close-up. All right, let's do our close-up here. Um, so starting in the lower right-hand corner here, um, you can see a bit of that metallic blue in there. See how it looks like there's like glitter in there? Um, go up to the upper right hand corner. So that darker color is the stone coat countertops. And the rest of the pigments in here are Lirens. So gorgeous turquoise, gorgeous purple. The white worked out very well. Um, so definitely initial review here is these are awesome pigments. They're very easy to mix with the resin. Um, definitely gorgeous. Let's get that glare out of there. There we go. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, definitely give these products a try. Just a reminder, link down in the description so you can purchase any of these products. Uh, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll see you next time.